Club. I even think back to like Smash 4, and I think it was Elegant versus MK Leo. I mean, just on paper, you know what I'm saying? Cloud obviously just clobbers Luigi, but the Luigi mains just dig deep and they just work around some of those longer disjointed characters. But no swordsman here. We do got a young man with the bat getting ready to jump here, here into game number one. Right, here we go. Pokemon Stadium 2, pretty classic stage you're going to see. Uh, platforms are going to be really helpful for Send, right? Because a lot of the times Luigi is going to be looking for that grab because he gets so much mileage out of it, especially sub 15%. He's at that range where if he gets grabbed, there's going to be a lot of damage off that throw. So be playing very patient out the gate. Send not committing to too much. Like he'll approach, but he's not committing to like anything like really big if he's in threats of being grabbed. Yeah, you know, he's he's approaching, but he's not committing. He's not he's not going to put a ring on it quite yet, you know what I'm saying? Still kind of dating around in the neutral, and that that's not uncommon with both of these two characters. I think both know how dangerous it is when one side gets their hands on the opposing side. And especially at these lower percents, like you said, that's when you really get to see that low percent Kung Fu come out. So right now, both players are really feeling each other out. Got to really give it to Kia Rash and how he's approaching this neutral. A lot of, a lot of Zares, you know what I'm saying? A lot of just uh, neutral specials, as we've seen in the past with the Mario Bros., Fireball might seem like a small thing. Oh my goodness, but speaking of a small thing at the ledge, that little yo-yo, that's that's supposed to be a toy, Austin. It's not supposed to hit like that. Dude, when I was a kid, I could walk the dog with that. I mean, that's an impressive thing. I mean, I, I could do it for like a second, but Ness, he can hang on to that smash for like five million years and it'll still kill. Man, that's actually crazy. You and I, we gotta kick it again one of these days. I, <laughs> my, my yo -yo <laughs> you got your yo-yo, you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready for. I'm ready for Oski facts to come back, my brother. Oh, but in the oh, meantime, never again. <laughs> <laughs> but in the meantime, though, we got to talk about the facts right here in this match, and there is no denying that Sen is obviously doing really well here. There's the falling up air, no down tilt, and again, just the fearlessness from Kia Rash getting the grab, not really getting too much out of it, but of course, sending that message, letting him know I am not afraid to box you up close. Ooh, and, you know. Oh, oh my gosh, you know. He gets a lot off that tether. Like, there's two times he's gotten a grab where I thought Send was in perfect safety. Like, but then, you know, that plunger goes a distance. Over that dash tag, good up smash out shield. Fantastic DI from Send, gonna allow him to survive. I like that he's, he's using the uh, neutral bead to try to, like, give himself some breathing room, but, like, you're gonna see a lot of down tilts. Oh, did Coming he up from Kia? Oh, wait. Okay, he get the second one, though. Send, you are yes. a god. This is God Send right here. Good lord. Yeah, okay. if, you, if you use that PK Thunder, you slam into that floor, the, the bottom of the stage, you can use it for another refresh, catches the landing or the falling of Luigi with another forward air, three stocks to one. Send is kind of carrying this, but there we go. Easy up smash, takes away the first stock. He's got kind of a hill to climb. If any character can do it, though, it's Luigi. If you can get a grab below 15, like, it could potentially lead into a kill. You know, Luigi's got those scary combos, especially if they uh, GI'd incorrectly. Oh, oh here we go. Up. Oh my goodness, the Luigi blender right here. Good lord, he already has a vacuum cleaner. Does he need a, a dang blender too? My Dude, lord. I mean, he's got he's got to make his smoothies after he's done cleaning the house. You know what I'm saying? So oh, there you go, my man, and looking to clean up this stock here nonetheless. This actually seems to be really difficult because you know, in the same turn of breath where I talked about neutral special from Luigi and just how uh, pivotal it is in certain matchups, I'm thinking of like if it's timed properly here with Sen, he'll just eat every one of them. So you already lose an approach option. So. You really got to find a way to get in and as safely as possible because there's no doubt in my mind that you're going to get some trades in here, okay? Not all these hits are going to be clean. Do you have enough percent here on your final stock to toss around? No way. Oh, that should be it. Yeah, that's yeah, that's catch it. Yeah. He caught him with the tail, dude. The tail of the PK Thunder off the end. That's pretty much what's going to seal that stock. I mean, that, that was a beautiful combo. The way he just, like, traversed that entirety of Pokemon Stadium 2. Just taking Send all the way to the left. And use, shooting out the PK Fire. Because even if he committed to a double jump, I'm pretty sure he's going to get caught by that PK Fire. And it was going to eat it. But good on Kia Rash. Holding on to it for as long as possible until he had to commit to the double jump. And even then, Send had every base covered. He put the tail down there, catched the double jump, and there was no way he was able to get back up there. This ain't Smash 4 anymore. You know that that Luigi Cyclone's not going to give him any sort of verticality. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Luigi Cyclone, there is uh, certainly a lot to be desired right there, I would imagine, inside of the Luigi Discord. But in terms of recovery. Yes, in terms of recovery. But it's still, a, I think all the tornado moves are still pretty hard to work around. But I, I will agree with you, though. It's not quite what it used to be here. But. Of course, we got to rock with the adjustments that we have here from iteration to iteration as we move into game number two. Now, Send obviously played that one very well, utilizing pretty much all points of the stage. And like you mentioned before, kind of taking Kid Rash from one end of Pokemon Stadium to the other. And when you think about that on paper, this ain't like Smashville, you know what I'm saying? If you're getting taken from one side of the stage to the other here, you're kind of getting you're kind of getting danced on. But I can't deny that Send played so well off stage versus Kid Rash. Oh, my goodness. The jab lock right into the super jump punch luigi 
laying out the big combos here. You gotta get those techs, dude. If you do, if you miss any sort of tech, your Kirash is gonna catch you slipping. And he did, absolutely did. A complete turnaround, wanting to take it right back to Pokemon Stadium 2 feels insanely comfortable here. And I would say, you know, if he can hold on to the stock for as long as possible, but then playing very aggressive. You saw he wanted to end that stock immediately out there, but Kirash denied it. Yeah, I mean, he got so much in the last game off of this dipping down with like forward air and there. Again, two options. Really, if you just flick the C stick in any direction. Oh, oh my goodness. He said, uh, send, my brother. How about you ascend up here into this blast zone? Send not looking so hot. And now it makes sense on how Kia Rash got this far. I mean, of course, it's a phenomenal player, but I, I get it now. Every basis of Luigi is covered. Oh, Lord, except that the recovery was... down there. Rod, that was so unfortunate. He got the uh, combustion on the side B, and it put him in a terrible position to recover. Yeah, that was just very unfortunate to say the least. But if there's one thing I can't say about Sand. Is, oh my goodness gracious! Is that you should not get your directional air dodge red. That's what I. That's what I was going to say. I promise, Twitch chat. But yes, yeah, Sand certainly has quite the hill to climb. How quickly the tables turn in a matchup again. Just one conversion can really rock your whole world. And I feel like no players on the screen right now know it better than these two in bracket. All right, here he goes. Not seeing too many fireballs coming out from Kia Rash, which is a lot of Luigi's neutral game plan. Like that's that's his huge part of his kit. And it's because he really can't do anything, especially oh. when he's off stage. Again, just eating up his recovery with the tail of PK Thunder. Like if you see Luigi trying to recover vertically, like that is like the perfect opportunity for Ness to get an Edgar with just like that. And now all of a sudden things are starting to even up. He goes off the ledge. He was in disadvantage, but he lands the PK fire to give himself some breathing room. And now he's suddenly center stage. That's right. This is a very dangerous position right here for a Ness of this caliber. I mean, this is not just a, this is the Ness right here. You give up a little bit of stage control. And of course, Sen can certainly spread it evenly here in the matchup. No grab. You know, he's looking for it. Of course, not enough to KO but certainly enough to get Luigi off stage, which is where Sen has been just really capitalizing here throughout this set, okay? There's the neutral special. No PK fire right here. Sen playing this one very safe. It's same to be said here for Kia Rash. Yeah, uh -oh. they're just kind of dancing around each other, waiting, both playing insanely safe. You're seeing that Kia Rash throwing out those zeros, throwing out the grabs, trying to get that uh, something going. We see a roll read. He's off stage. This is where Sen, uh, Kia Rash has been uh, struggling goes for the down B Luigi Cyclone to break through the defense and all of a sudden he's turned the tables on him. Can you get a recovery off of this? Oh, Try to maybe eat the PK Thunder with the plunger, dude. He almost got it. I man, good lord. Something about that Dr. E guy tech right there, man. The back throw might be enough. Oh, but great match mm -hmm. out. No spin to win and no around the world. Good lord. A lot of spaghetti here, homie. Somebody show me some sauce and quick. Okay. Slamming on that controller to escape that grab, and now all of a sudden, really high percents for both players. You see Kia Rash looking for that potential opening with a fireball. Throw, gets grabbed, up throw, not going to get the kill. Ooh. Using PK Thunder, gets caught by the normal one and not the big boy. Bets it all on the down B, gets punished by the back air, still alive, 160%. Can he get back to this stage? Eats through the PK Thunder with an up air, but gets caught by the nair. That is going to be another game and send the reverse three stock. That was like almost in the back for Kia Rash, and Sen just said, nah, man, this is my game, my you set. I mean, of course, this is just what separates, you know, of course, Sen from a lot of the other Nesses. I mean, this this young man, still a young man. I mean, this young man in the community have been playing since 2016, so obviously hasn't, you know, been in as long as like some of the, maybe the Brawl vets, you know what I'm saying, who, who are still rocking and rolling. But honestly, if you had just met Sen, you would never know this man's resume definitely speaks for itself. He knows how to be clutch. He knows how to dig deep in some of those final moments and really clutch out some great conversions in the neutral. I mean, we've seen it right there. Kia Rasha, again, no shot at them. Played very well, but again, it's not about how you start. you got to finish those stocks correctly. And I think both of these two characters do a phenomenal job at putting on percent. They both have options when the percent start to rise to clean up the stocks, but Sen just utilize it a little bit better. So next game right here, friends, game number three. Pokemon at Stadium, we're going to see who's going to be the very best like no one ever was. Because as it looks like right now, Send is just moving and grooving. Kier Rasto really struggling right now. Yeah, man, he, he's struggling to get those, those grabs. Again, that vulnerable at 15% mark, if you get a lot of those grabs, and he is failing to catch them. Just like this Pokemon, man, I, mean, I don't think he's going to be the best here. Maybe potentially. Here we go again. I mean, every single time he throws out that fireball, there is an absorption coming in. It's going to heal Ness. It's going to be able to give him some health, some percentage back. So I think that's another thing. It's just kind of destroying his game plan. I think he wanted that PK Thunder to go underneath him, dog. Oh, my 
like lord jesus that would have been absolutely filthy but you know what though i feel like it's a little bit of retaliation on how some of those combos hit in game number two on kia rash's behalf there's the pk fire oh okay no missile okay great stuff saving the jump they're down so that the ledge checking those fingers homie as long as kia rash holds on to his double jump off stage you can make it back but when he gets back on there's gonna be an up air Fantastic, just run off the platform up air. Really fast way to get your air out of there as well as to get the kill. Fantastic air dodge. Ness has to get so much mobility off of that air dodge to get back onto it diagonally onto the ledge. And now all of a sudden, here comes the damage. That's right. I like that pivot grab there just a moment before. That's something that most characters with, I guess, Luigi's grab would technically be a tether. That's something that you kind of have to kind of take into consideration. You know, you grabbing in the neutral, especially a character like Ness, not the easiest feat in the world. So sometimes you got to put a little footwork on it to get some magic going. And I got to say, man, despite Kiraz not doing so well in this game, I love the ledge trapping, Uh, you know, just positions that he's been in there just a, a few moments ago, using like grab at the ledge to constantly reposition him. And good Lord, putting Sen in the position for another up special. Kia Rash, good Lord. He is just yeah, on the left today. Okay, that looks slimy, dude. Uh, Kia Rash was running into him. I'm pretty sure he wasn't expecting the full frontal assault from that PK Thunder. I thought maybe he was going to like jump, but then he just got caught. So there was something that went wrong there. And that's going to put Sen in a fantastic positioning to take home this set, dude. One stock away, making guaranteeing himself in winner's finals. I'd like to see Kia Rash possibly slow this match down a little bit. And what I mean by that is, again, I'm not saying Sen is an overly aggressive player. I mean, Sen, of course, you know, rises to the occasion, you know, whichever way he needs to. But I like Luigi's anti-air options that he kind of has on Ness. You catch Ness floating around you, toss out the up smash. You know what I'm saying? Try to land with your uh, your frame three nair, I believe. That's what Luigi's nair is. I'm not sure if it's any faster or any slower here in this game. But regardless, it comes out quick. And it's a good break option. But... You yeah. might not not only that, but you got the you got the Luigi Cyclone. That that's frame one, dude. Like it comes out super quick. Yeah. Speaking oh. of, gonna be able to get a combo off of it yet again, off of the throw, gets the stock off the top, and now all of a sudden Kia Rash has some fight left at him. He challenges that PK Thunder so much. It's so daring of him, but it, it gets a lot of reward off of it, so I don't blame him. You gotta be fearless, man. Just as fearless as tossing oh. there off the a shield while you're caught into the corner. Okay. Trying to hit him with the fireworks. He's no done. PK Thunder. Time and yay out of gas luigi great recovery system but it's like a game of jenga though if you take one piece away from it it just all falls apart phenomenal job by sen valiant effort by kia rash but sen's going to close us out in a pretty dominant 3-0 yeah, a fantastic 3-0 and if you, you guys if you also want to get a 3-0 in bracket you can actually check out send on metafy he's got that uh coaching going on right now if you want to learn from the best of the best probably the best ness out there that's a way to go so i know he's, he's like one of the few players we got still in the bracket that's got one of those uh, metafies, which, you know, this tournament's actually sponsored by. So shout out to them. Got a lot of coaching going on over there. But yeah, yeah. Sen's going to move through the bracket, move on into winner's finals. And, uh, you know, we're not done with Kia Rash, right? Like, he's still in the loser's side.